Philippians, Central America, North America, roundabout, I say praise the Lord. We pray together. Father, in the name of Jesus, thank you for this wonderful day. Thank you for your glorious act over our lives. Thank you, Lord, for our pastor, the convener. Thank you, Lord God Almighty, for our leaders right about us here. We're blessed today for the way you have been keeping them. So you be the glory forever and ever in Jesus' name. We are starting in the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, by the authority of the Holy Spirit. Arise, O oh Lord, take adoration in Jesus' name. I'll start, we start every right now by praising your name. Blessed Father, let the host of heaven join us. Let the host of heaven join us. Lift it up, royal hand, even unto the glorious Father, in Jesus' name. In Jesus' victorious name, we are prayed. A better amen. By the time the convener will be here, he will want to hear the distinct ekitistate amen. In Jesus' name we pray. God bless you, my people. I read Psalm 145. Psalm 145. As you want to ex Every day will I bless thee, and I will praise thy name forever and never. Great is the Lord, and greatly to be praised. All counselors report in the hall of meeting. All counselors, wherever you may be from all regions, report in that place now. Great is the Lord, and great let to be praised, and his greatness is unsearchable. Brothers and sisters, thank God we are living witnesses to what has been happening through the covenant concerning GCK. Starting from January this year, on and on like that one throughout all those months, the Lord has been keeping a servant. I say the Lord will be keeping our father in the law, sustaining him. Once again, all counselors, your attention is needed in the campus hall here now. You can see the campus hall there. All counselors from all the regions, and I do here, go there. We need to share a communion unto the Most High God for his goodness in this church and for the body of believers. How the Lord will be helping us, transforming lives, emancipating here and there, deliverance here and there. We need to praise the Lord who is doing it. Do you agree with me? I said, do you agree with me? The Lord that is helping us, loading us with benefit every day. He has forgiven sins. He has pardoned sinners. And that is the most high God. Where you are right now, I want you to lift up your hands unto the Lord and say, Father, we thank you. For what you are doing presently, we thank you. For what you have done in January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, and here now, December, what you are going to do, we thank you. We are those that can lift up their hands unto the Lord and praise his holy name. Are they here? Are they here? Be one of those people that know what the Lord is doing. And praise his holy name. The Lord is wonderful. The Lord is wonderful. No wonder the psalmist says, his doings are unsearchable. They are unsearchable. Praise the Lord, oh my soul. And don't forget all his benefits. Worship the Lord. Exalt his holy name. Exalt his holy name. The Lord that will be keeping all our leaders for us. The Lord that will be helping 
all our mentors for us. Let's worship the Lord. Let's exalt his holy name. Who is like unto the O Lord in all the world? How about wherever? Praise the Lord, O oh my soul. And don't forget his benefit. And don't forget his benefit. And don't forget his benefit. Worship the Lord in the beauty of his holiness. Exalt his holy name. Let's thank the Lord for the excellency of his greatness. He makes this happen. He makes this happen. Let's worship the Lord. Let's bless his holy name. I will praise you, O Lord, with all my life. I will praise you, O Lord, with all my life. I will praise you with all my life, O Lord. Let everything that has breath in it praise the Lord. Are you praising the Lord? Are you one of those that are praising the Lord? Let's worship the Lord. Let's magnify his holy name. Let's bless the Lord. In Jesus' name we are praying. A better equity. Amen. We are going to praise the Lord for our Father in the Lord. Moving from one region to the other, from one state to the other, here and there like that one, and the word of God coming out with power and signs following. Father, for the way you are not nurturing him, for the way you are helping him, for the way you are empowering him, eternal Father, we worship you. Hope you are to praise the Lord for the man of God. For the man of God, let's worship the Lord. The strength from above, his pressure from above, divine touch from above. Let's worship the Lord. Let's exalt a solid name for our mother in the Lord and the entire family. Let's worship the Lord. Let's worship the Lord. Let's exalt a solid name. Let's bless the Lord for the man of God, for his pressure from on high. If not for the Lord, if not for the Lord, we need to worship the Lord. We need to bless his holy name. We need to exalt his holy name. We need to worship him. In Jesus' name we are praying. You are going to praise the Lord for yourself. You know, if the Lord had not been with you, the enemy would have loved you to scan. But the Lord did not grant the desires of the wicked concerning you and I. What does he say, Father? I thank you. I thank you, O Lord. 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 You did not allow the desires of the wicked to come to pass concerning my life, concerning your life. Father, thank you. Father, thank you. Let's worship the Lord. Let's exalt his holy name. Let's exalt his holy name. In Jesus' name we are praying. Say, Amen. Amen. Open your eyes. Wonders will happen here. Look at the way you are saying Amen. I say, Wonders will happen here. Miracles, instantaneous one will happen here. And you are one of the beneficiaries. I am sure you are one. I say I am one. I say I am one. Father, for what you are going to do here, we praise your name. Open your name and bless the name of the Lord. Open your mouth and bless the Lord. For the miracle signs and wonders that will happen here. My salvation. My salvation. Chronic sinners will be saved. Chronic sinners will be saved. Open your mouth and bless the Lord. For what the Lord is going to do here. For what the Lord is going to do here. For what the Lord is going to do here. In Jesus' name we are praying. Amen. We are going to pray for the man of God. The convener. Our father, my father, your father. From time to time. Moving here and there like that one. Eternal father, be his strength. I say, be his strength. Be his strength. Hope you're about to pray for him right now. Let's call upon the Lord for the man of God. For the man of God. Let's pray for him. 
Let's worship him. I say, Father, to you be the glory for what you have done. We are just praying. You strengthen him the more. In Jesus' name, we are praying. My brethren, it happened in Joshua chapter 13. The Lord came to Joshua and said, Joshua, you are old and striking in years. You know where the truth is speaking the truth. What do you expect? Nevertheless, the assignment I've given unto you, all day you will not stop it. That's why you are going to pray for the man of God. All day you will never stop him. I don't take that to me. I say all day you will not stop him for the Lord. Open your mouth and pray. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. His days shall be renewed like the eagle. It will be a precedented event happening here and there in his life. For the Lord himself will fill up his servant. And he will minister from his nation. Receive from heaven. Call upon the Lord. The Lord will strengthen him the more. Our mommy also, the Lord will strengthen her the more. A reliable companion. Uh, let's pray. Your mighty God will strengthen them all. In Jesus' name, we are praying. A better amen. amen. Now, open your eyes and look at me here. Right away from January. I'm not even talking about that of last year. Even from January to this present time. Thousands upon thousands. I'll be one for the Lord. It has been joy galore in heaven. Because of those saved souls. You are going to decree. You say, Lord, those saved souls from January, GCK, February, March, April, May, June, and the one that will be happening here, none of them will go back to the world. I say, none of them will go back to the world. Open your mouth and pray. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. All the fruit of the GCK program, they will abide. They will abide. They will be consolidated. And they are going to become part of the disciple. The church of God will be increasing in wonders, in worshipers, in workers, in worship centers. And the word of God will be greatly increased. Call upon the Lord. I want to believe all our brethren from all other outside locations. They are praying as it is written. You have not chosen me, but I have chosen you. And ordain you to go and bring forth fruit. And our fruit shall abide. Our fruit will abide. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. In Jesus' name, we are praying. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Source will be one in this program. Do you believe? I said, do you believe? Genuine salvation. I said, genuine salvation. Have you heard of a situation whereby somebody that has been detained, yes, go and follow that person up. The person to be followed up, even go to the church because, before the person that I've been sent to go and follow him up. Real concrete salvation this time around. You are going to pray. Oh Lord, let there be rain of salvation in the city state. Can you pray and call upon the Lord? Rain of salvation. Torrential rain of salvation. Torrential rain of salvation. Chronic sinner will be saved in this program. Pray and call upon the Lord. Pray and call upon the Lord. Pray and call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. Call upon His holy name. Call upon His holy name. In Jesus' name we are praying. Wherever you are, let me hear your ekitiyeme that is different from that of other Nigerians. In Jesus' name we pray.
those that have testimonies from the previous, previous uh, programs that you have been having right away since we have started this DCK, can you come to my left hand side? You will see our leaders there. You need to praise the Lord with the testimony God has given unto you. Once again, wherever you may be now, either far or near, we want you at the left hand side of the podium. If you have got your testimony from the previous outings of the GCK. Amen. We want to pray like we have never prayed before. Are you ready? Let those that are real prayer warriors say, I am a prayer warrior. Can I hear you? You mean it? I will give you the prayer request now. Since January, our Father and the Lord have been moved from one state in Nigeria to the other one. We are going to call upon the Lord. Oh Lord, turn Nigeria around for Jesus Christ. Turn Nigeria around for Jesus Christ. Hope you are to pray. We are the prayer warriors that are praying. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. Call out to me. And I will show you greater and mighty things. The Lord has promised it can never fail. He said, My covenant will not break, nor utter the thing that has gone out of my mouth. As he said it, it will, it will do it. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. It is time, oh Lord. It is time, oh Lord. Turn Nigeria around, oh Lord God, for your gospel. For your gospel. In Jesus' name we are praying. Nigeria for Jesus. I say Nigeria for Jesus. Oh Lord. All the heart of men that have heard the gospel in this country, let them bow before Christ. Hope you might have prayed now. Either kings, governors, presidents, whosoever, senators, whosoever that had heard the gospel, since we have been moving about here and there, that one will not die. 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 Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. In Jesus' name we are prayed. In Jesus' name we are prayed. We are going to call upon the Lord. In this edition, the grand finale for this year, Eternal Father, you plan it yourself. It is beyond human imagination. Lord, that big fish, that chronic sinner, I don't know their numbers, that what was safe in this program, no one will escape. Ha, look at the way you say amen. I said no one will escape. Open your mouth and decree. Open your mouth and decree right now. Open your mouth, open your mouth, open your mouth. And say, Lord, no one, no one of them will escape. The gospel net will catch them now. The gospel net will catch them now. In Jesus' name we are praying. Yeah. Now, let's say to me, what of the sinner in your family? Your brother, your sister, your husband, your wife, your sons, your daughters, your niece, your nephew, you will mention the name. You say, Lord, Lord, in this program, he or she must be saved. Is it possible? I say, is it possible? Yes. Open oh, your mouth and pray right now. If it is possible, say, Lord, I bring my brother before you. I bring my son before you. Eternal Father, let him be saved. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. In Jesus' name we are praying. Look at me here. This program is for my testimony. Okay, Satan is saying you should not say it very well. This program is for my testimony. That is why you are going to pray. Oh Lord, I have come. Not as a spectator, but share our testimony. Open your mouth and pray. Let me hear you now. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. 
call upon the Lord. I am a major participant. Not a mere spectator. No. 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 In Jesus' name we are praying. Hope you ask my brethren something upon the scripture. The Lord Jesus Christ was going to the house of Jairus. His mission was go to, to go and raise up that daughter. But before he got there, something happened. We call it destiny encounter. Something happened before Jesus Christ got to that place. The woman with the issue of blood came and touched Jesus. Where is the woman here tonight? Where is that person that's touching Jesus Christ tonight? Destiny encounter. Can I hear from you? Destiny encounter. That what are the situation of things concerning your life? You say, Lord, I have come here. I have come here. It is time for my destiny encounter. My destiny is a counter transformation by the Lord right now. Open your mouth and pray. Call upon the Lord. 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 You say, Lord, I have come here in your presence. Arise, O Lord. That one that they call impossible. Eternal Father, prove them as liars. Do it for me, O Lord. It is destiny encounter. It is destiny encounter. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. In Jesus' name we are praying. Open your eyes. You have been sitting down in all your locations. Here and there, you see people sharing testimony. When is it going to come to your turn? Oh, look, I thank God for the choir members. I say, when is it going to come to your turn? You will say, now. I say, when is it going to come to your turn? Then you are going to shout. I say, you will lift up your eyes to the heaven. Father, it is my turn. Father, it is my turn. Is this how to pray for your turn? It is my turn. 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 In Jesus' name we are praying. Listen to me. I want to give you this prayer request. If you are able to pray on this prayer request, I'm telling you, you will be celebrated. It's not the time you negotiate with the devil. Since you are here, our fathers in the Lord, workers, they are praying that whosoever will come here tonight, the life will not remain the same again. Yeah. And in all other locations around the world, we are praying, whosoever will gather together in spirit to be part of the congregation, the life will not remain the same again. Yeah. Don't negotiate with the devil. Don't argue. Don't say, how is it going to happen? You will say, Lord, can I hear you? Lord, Lord, Lord. open the book of my testimony now. Open the book of my testimony now. Open the book of my testimony now. Is this how I will go in this world? Open the book of my testimony now. Open the book of my testimony now. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. Call upon the Lord. Open the book of my testimony now. In Jesus' name we are praying. In Jesus' name we are praying. Father, in Jesus' name. We want to appreciate you, Lord, that eventually, at last, here we are before the holy presence in a stage. The other time, Taraba live, Bayesa live, Ibori live. Now, Ado Ekiti live. Father, let there be living testimony over every one of us in Jesus' name. Glorious encounter over every one of us in Jesus' name. Even our Father in the Lord. He has been ministering. 
He has been going to state. Papa, you are welcome to a critical state. The administrator of the convener of GCK. In a kitty state, he's going to be unprecedented. Yeah. Pastor will say, what is happening here? What is happening here? What is happening here? So I be Jesus' name. Yeah. Eternal Father, we're coming the program onto your hands. We pray your grace will speak for us. Yeah. Your grace will speak for us. And as we are saying amen here right now, Father, any kind of problem that can be of disturbance to any participant, I command that problem to disappear. In the name of Jesus. You be with our choir members. You help all our ministers. Thank you, Father, for having answered. In Jesus' victorious name, we are praying. It is a glorious amen. In Jesus' name. Victorious name, we are praying. Yeah. The final amen that brings your testimony down. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Welcome to GCK Live in Ekiti State, Southwest Nigeria. We begin with prelude now as we move to praise and worship. to the Lord all ye land come before his presence with singing as we come before the Lord worshiping the Lord in beauty of holiness I want to assure you that this first day of the global crusade you will be a recipient of the blessing of the Lord you are welcome and I want to join I want you to join us to praise God in the beauty of holiness you will have your blessing in the name of Jesus Amen. When 
I come into your presence, I'm so happy. When I come into your presence, I'm so glad. In your presence, there is anointing. Your spirits move around me. In your presence, anointing breaks the yoke. When I come, yes, I'm so happy. We are happy together. When I come to your presence, I'm so glad. I'm so glad in your presence. There is anointing. Your
global hallelujah praise ye the lord surely it's time for your great transformation and you are going into total complete triumph in jesus name why don't you just tell god just briefly that lord i'm already here for you i'm already connected and i'm already listening my hearts are open unto you and i'm ready to receive I'm not settling for anything less than great transformation for total triumph. Tell the Lord. As we are telling the Lord here in the Alpha location in Adrekiti here, all over the world, in every nation, in every continent, you are equally talking to the Lord. And really, you will find that it's your turn and it's your time for Great transformation for total triumph. Father, in the name of Jesus, we give you all the praise, we give you all the glory because you have done all things well for us already. That this day was fixed, 22nd December 2022, and you have granted us. And here we are gathered in your presence. And you have even been waiting here for us all to come to your presence. And in all other places where we are gathered together unto you, for normally, all our gatherings, they are unto you. We pray, O oh Lord, that beginning from this day one, you will make a full manifestation of yourself that every participant, whether the Alpha location or connected through the social media or gathered somewhere, listen and getting connected to this program, nobody will be left untouched in Jesus' name. It is time for our great transformation, transformation of all sorts, complete, total, all-round transformation for honor and triumph. Father, we pray that in the name of Jesus, you will effect it in every life in Jesus' name. And your instrument that you have prepared to use, your word will have free course through him in the name of Jesus. And it will touch every area of our lives, bringing down, the, bringing down our desired blessings in Jesus' name. Thank you very much, O oh Lord, because you have answered us. In Jesus' name, we pray. Another amen. amen. As we keep standing up here and everywhere, we bring out our program sheet and we turn to page two so that we sing together. 
the very first song there, Jesus only is our message. Jesus only is our message. Jesus all our theme shall be. We will lift up Jesus ever. Jesus only will we see. Jesus only is our savior. All our guilt he bore away. All our righteousness he gives us. All our strength from day to day. Jesus is a sanctifier, cleansing us from self and sin, and with all his spirit's fullness, filling all our hearts within. Jesus only is a healer, all our sicknesses he bear, and his risen life and fullness, all his members still may share. Jesus only is our power, his, the gift of Pentecost. Jesus, breathe thy power upon us, fill us with the Holy Ghost. And for Jesus, we are waiting listening for the trumpet sound, then it will be us and Jesus living ever with our God. Jesus only, Jesus ever. Jesus all in all we sing, Savior, Sanctifier, Healer, Baptizer, and Coming King.
Praise the Lord. We thank the Lord for the global crusade with Pastor Dr. W.F. Kumui. We are in the December edition 2022. We thank the Lord for what he has done in the past. Here we are in a kitty state, southwest Nigeria. And we thank the Lord that we are alive to see this program again, which has blessed many people worldwide. And there you are in, the, in your location, all over the globe. This program is coming to us, and we need to pray. We, we need to start, first of all, by praising the Lord for what he has done in the past. And we need to praise the Lord for, his, for the success of the past programs, uh, which has blessed many people, as we have said. And we see the move of God all around the nations of the world. Numerous blessings of salvation, healing, provision, protection, and deliverance have been seen and witnessed by everyone. In Psalm 105, verses 1 and 2, we see there that the Bible makes us to know that we should talk about the blessings of God when that we have witnessed. Say, oh, give thanks unto the Lord, call upon his name, make known his deed among the people, sing unto him, sing psalms unto him, Talk ye of all his wondrous works. We need to talk about the wondrous works of the Lord because it has been great. And we have witnessed it. And we need to praise him and worship him for his love, the salvation of souls, miracles, provisions, and uh, material blessings and resources that God has made available. Remember, we are in a state of global miracle, uh, economic difficulties all over the world. But during this time, God has not failed his people. So we need to praise him and worship him for the great things we, he has done. And as we prepare for this uh, global crusade again, we are going to pray. Everybody should pray. We need to talk to God about what we need at this time. We need his presence because without prayers, we couldn't have gone, gotten what we have gotten. We know when the GCK started the first time, you know as I know that many of us did not get the vision. Many of us did not know what was coming. But as time was going on, we, ha we are catching the vision. As we know better, we are going to pray better. As we had gotten a vision that this is not a one-man project, it is a global project, we are going to pray a global prayer with global faith. Let's open our mouth and talk to the Lord in prayer. Talk to the Lord and ask for blessings from the heaven that God will move in the midst of his people. We are going to talk about the, how this program will be a blessing to every one of us. There you are in your country, you are there in America, you are there in Asia, you are there in Europe, in Africa, everywhere, globally. In your personal house, you are there. Open your mouth and talk to the Lord so that God will move in the midst of his people. We need to talk about some things for this program to hold. You know as I know that the devil is not happy that these things are happening, that souls are being snatched from hell and being pushed into heaven, be, being rushed into heaven. People who have lost hope in life, God is bringing hope to them through this program. So we need to pray and ask God to move in our midst. What do we do? We are going to ask for open heaven. When our Lord Jesus Christ came out of the water in Mark chapter 1, verse 10, you look, read your Bible, you will see it. He said, the heavens opened. And when heaven opened, there was a voice from heaven that spoke. Go, heaven will open so that the man of God, that God is going to use this time when he speaks, no, the, no part of that speaks will resist him. Let's, let's also pray for open heaven so that they be anointed, double anointed on the man of God as a preacher. Now all ministers who are going to minister at this time, open your mouth and pray and talk to God in prayer concerning that there will be open heaven for us. They, let's pray for peaceful environment. There should be peace. Without peace, what can we do? The devil thrives in upheaval, in unrest, in political problems all, all over the nations. We see in, in Ukraine there is war there going on, and uh, this is social inf infrastructure has been devastated and people are suffering. We know in Ethiopia there is no peace there, there is civil war. We know.